Hey, Lou and Will, I'm a big fan from Brazil. Changing the subject from tech to sports, what is your expectation for the final of the NBA? Will the Raptors win? If so, how many games? How can I not pick the Raptors? Toronto, Kawhi Leonard. Prior to Kawhi Leonard, we had DeMar DeRozan on the show upstairs on Box Therapy. Uh, Raptors fan since day one. A relatively recent franchise to be added to the NBA and now in the NBA Finals. And I'm telling you, I looked over the past, like, 20 years, it's not that many teams. You see a lot of the same teams showing up. For example, Golden State, fifth consecutive year in the finals. But I got to go with the Raptors. How are they going to win defense? Slowing the game down, clogging it up, uh, keeping Golden State out of transition. Kevin Durant's not going to play game one. I'll be there at game one. Keep an eye out for me. I'll be under the basket somewhere. Wherever it was that Jack and Will were sitting earlier. I'm a, I'll be like under the basket somewhere, game one. Uh, I'll be giving Drake a run for his money with the antics. No, I won't, but I'll be nearby is what I'm trying to say. No one can touch the Drake antics at this point. It's impossible. He's, uh, he's hit next level antics. It's, uh, he's in people's heads. Well done. Do what you got to do. So far, so good. NBA finals. So far, so good. Far as I can tell. So I'm going with the Raptors. I'm going to take all seven games, though. It's going, to take, it's going to take everything we got. But home court advantage. Game seven in Toronto. So I'll be at game one. I don't know if I'll be at game seven if it makes it. But I'm going to take the Raptors in seven. Defense is going to win it. Kawhi Leonard, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, need I say more? Kawhi and Dine. I, already, I said on Twitter. Like, people were offering Kawhi things. Somebody offered him a penthouse if he sticks around. Uh, so, uh, other uh, establishments are offering him free food, Uber and Lyft drivers, free lifts everywhere he wants to go. So I also offered up my services. I don't even know how I can be useful, but tech support, 1-800-LOU-LATER, tech support, I'm open. Uh, uh, personalized product reviews, I'm open. Oh my God, let me tell you something crazy right now, Will. That Right there, what you're looking at, that's my old house. No. Yes, I can't believe you brought up this image live. I, li I used to live there. I promise you, where this mural is painted, that was my wall. On the other side of that was, is my kitchen and my living room. Hmm. I, don't, I don't need to go into any more details on that. Yes. And I don't know why they let them paint that there. Uh, the owner must have been cool with it. Probably a Raptors fan. Maybe it's going to get taken down at a later date. But these things are popping up all over the city. That's the level it's at right now. And, uh, and it's just crazy. I was, I was actually at Dairy Queen last night. Dairy Queen's got a new blizzard, by the way. Uh, it's an O. Henry peanut butter combination blizzard. Okay? You can't have it, Will. I apologize. No. But, but the whole family had it. And it was, my goodness gracious... It was a whole thing. So just to be clear. And, and in the Dairy Queen, some people in the world might not know what Dairy Queen is. It's ice cream. Okay? It's wonderful. Show them the blizzard. Uh, 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 o. Henry peanut butter blizzard. Show it to them. It's a limited time only, by the way. So get yourself in there. Uh, look, at, look at this. Unbelievable. And they show it upside down because they flip it upside down when you go to buy it. Because they got to let you know it's the real deal. It's real thick ice cream. It ain't going to drip out, you see. So they, they, they put it upside down when you buy it. Well, you don't have to get O. Henry. It's got peanuts. You could get Oreo. Okay? All right. So there's options. All right. Uh, there's not free options for Willie Duke. Anyhow, I'm in the Dairy Queen, and the, the TV has the news on, and they show... The dude who, who, who painted, this is last night. They show the dude who painted this because it just happened. And they're interviewing him like, hey, man, what's the inspiration? Who are you? How can people, you know, this kind of thing. And I'm like, what? I'm like, that's my house, my old house. And then on top of that, I go, I snap a photo of it, of the screen, so that people would believe me. And then you, without us even having this conversation, you bring up this particular image. It's incredible. Mm. A mirror. Jack, can you stop it? Jack's trying. Jack, don't take it there, man. 
There are a lot of these murals popping up uh, all over the city. This is a beloved character. People want him to stick around. Sports. Don't start with the sports thing, okay? It's important. Culture. Even if you don't watch sports, go play a sport. Do something. Get active. Compete. It's good for the mind. Good for the body. You know that, Will? Mm -hmm. All right, get out there, Absolutely. Will. Absolutely. Get out there, Will. Do something. I, I walk. <laughs> but you walk like it's a sport. Yeah, that's... Yeah. 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 So I had a big argument, you know, sports, Game of Thrones. It's like you, you're not allowed to like both. That was what was happening on my Twitter. And uh, getting back to the Game of Thrones thing, I saw the guy checked himself into rehab. Yeah. He's not... He, he's Snow. Dist he's distraught. It didn't go down the way he wanted. He's as, uh, as upset as the fans are. And then I saw the clip of him doing the table read yeah. with the with the princess or uh, the queen. Daenerys. With the queen. Targaryen. And he's breaking down. Like, is it, uh, man, what a, what a, I think that, and, and people said this under the tweet, they're like, this clip is better than the whole show. This is my argument, real life. The best drama there is. Real life. And that was a real life moment, man. That was no acting. That man was hurt in that moment. And I guess, so I, I guess that we just, is this a spoiler alert situation? I don't know. The show happened already. The show's over. But he found out some news in the script read live and he breaks down crying. Yeah. Devastation. Devastation. And then you come to find out he checks himself into rehab. Holy moly. It's very intense. It's very insane. So the argument shouldn't be sports or the other. It's like there's a place for narrative. There's a place for discovery in the arts. And there's a place for discovery and human testing and human will and competition through sports. It's all wonderful. Keep it up. Get out there. And uh, Jack just, he did this to me. Jack just did this to me. He thinks that since he's sitting over there, he gets to decide when to cut it. <laughs> so he said it's such a high that it's the time time to end the show but effectively killing the high in doing so so on that note ladies and gentlemen toronto raptors game one thursday tomorrow i'll be there and uh, keep an eye out for me it's we need all the love we can get at this point it's the golden state warriors five consecutive we need all the love we can get i mean if you're a game of thrones fan basketball fan if uh, you, hello kitty it doesn't matter. We'll take you on board right now. We need it all. Send the love. Send the wishes. Leave it in the comments. Let's go Raptors. Go Raptors.